Welcome back. Tomorrow at this time, we will know whether or not the Lobos will still be alive in the NCAA tournament. Our own Van Tate is in St. Louis on the Lobos matchup with Stanford tomorrow. Van. Losing to Harvard in the NCAA tournament last season left such a sting that guard Hugh Greenwood said he wanted to fast forward this season. 27 wins later, here we are. The Lobos are facing their first obstacle in the NCAA tournament tomorrow in Stanford. We've taken every game like it could be our last, really. So I think that's helped us prepare for this, uh, this, these situations where um, we're literally, you know, if you lose, the season's done. Like all of their games, the Lobos are looking to make this one physical. It should be a good challenge for us. You know, you got a lot of good bigs and good, good guard play, and uh, it should be a good challenge for our, our guys. You know, we're a veteran group and understand um, the opportunity we have. More excites me is the the challenge that we're going to face with just how physical they are and and how relentless they are. I think I think both both teams have a challenge to stop the bigs inside. Um, obviously, he's a little bit more athletic and handles the ball a little bit more within their offense. Staying out of foul trouble will be key as both teams try to navigate through new NCAA rules that produce a lot of whistles against physical play this year. Well, I got to be careful. I don't come out, you know. <laughs> playing too aggressive and, and you know, pick up some early fouls because not only are we going to be nervous and anxious, yeah. but the officials are going to be nervous and anxious trying to get those first few calls out of the way. Right. So um, with us, you know, we're a very, very physical team, so we can't afford to get in foul trouble. You can still be physical in the paint and screening and stuff if you do it the right way, and that's what we've tried to do. On the defensive end, both teams are stout. The Lobos are fourth in the country in defense against two-point field goals. They will be facing a Stanford team that really doesn't shoot the three that much, but that could change. As far as bench play is concerned, there's not much for the Cardinal. Their starters score 87.1% of their offense. Lawrence, back to you.